morning everyone and happy Saturday. Welcome back to my channel. Now it's around 11.30 a.m. and I have had the most relaxing morning. So because I'm doing an internship at the moment at ABC uh, News Breakfast TV, I do wake up quite early during the week. So it was nice to have a good lie in this morning until like 9.30. Usually I wake up at like 3 a.m. during the week, but I am loving my internship. It's been so much fun. And yeah, so this morning was good. It was good to catch up on some sleep. And you know, I even did a bit of reading this morning in bed. I had a read of Open Wide by Melissa Ambrosini, which you would have seen me buy in last week's weekend vlog. So yeah, that was really good. And I even did some journaling, some meditation. I'm feeling so relaxed and just like rejuvenated. It's amazing what sleep can do. So that's been my morning. I also changed my hair color in case you couldn't tell. I've gone back to brunette again because I just feel like this color is more me you know I loved being blonder and having that balayage effect but I just feel like this is more me and so it's good to be back to yeah this color I love it so I got it done at um, major chase salon which is in Windsor and my friend Jen runs it so yeah, I'm loving it. So shout out to Jen. Thank you for bearing with me as I keep changing my mind on my hair, but this color is here to stay. So yeah, I've had a really good morning. I don't have too many plans this weekend. It's more just about relaxing and maybe doing a bit of shopping. I'll catch up with my family. So stay tuned and I'll bring you along with me. This week, I've also received some exciting PR packages. So the first one is from Urban Brew. I love this. A yawn is a silent scream for coffee that is too true they've sent me some coffee pods and also a chalk wafer cone to put my coffee in which is so cool that's going to be delicious but I love this message it says a happy person wants 10,000 things a sick person just wants one and that definitely makes me think so it's all about yeah this time of year definitely is all about you know spreading the love, spreading the Christmas spirit. And sometimes it's just the little things in life that make a big difference. And yeah, I can't wait to try the coffee pods out. We are running a giveaway, so stay tuned. I also received some skincare goodies from 18B. We've got their Hydrate and Restore Rich Cream, as well as their Firm and Replenish Serum, which I'm so excited, especially for the serum because I love serums and this one sounds incredible. I've read up a bit online about it, but um, I'll definitely give this one a go too. So stay tuned. I'll do some reviews on Instagram so yeah head on over to Frenchie by Chelsea Elizabeth on Instagram to see more and for today's OOTD I'm wearing this really pretty off-the-shoulder top from forever new I've got my Marge pink stone earrings my MIH or my jeans from Netta Porter and my Chanel slingback heels so that is my look for today keeping it really simple and just yeah nice casual weekend vibes but the top does add a bit of like more of a dressy element to the look so it's yeah perfect for a Saturday. So I'm here at our bar in the Crown Towers lobby area and it's really lovely here today because they've got all of the Christmas decorations up and kids are like running crazy because they've all spotted Santa inside the um, atrium over there but I've just got my soy flat white so cheers guys I really need this this morning even though I did have a sleep in I feel like I kind of overslept a little bit so I'm feeling extra tired today so a good coffee is exactly what I need hey you're good at making me lose my mind but I always come around don't I DJs, David Jones. We're like the waves on a big blue storm you see. It's now around 9 p.m. and I'm heading out for dinner. 
Yes, heading out at 9 p.m. for dinner. I'm so hungry, guys, seriously. But I'm going to Rockpool at Crown, which I'm really excited about. I've gotten dressed up for the occasion. I'm wearing this Manning Cartel blush denim jacket, which I've had in my wardrobe for a long time. I feel like it matches this hair color really well. I used to wear it all the time, so it's back out again. And then I've got my Forever New uh, black blouse underneath this. And then I've also got my Zara leggings, my Stuart Weitzman open-toed heels. And yeah, that's my look for tonight. I'm really looking forward to heading out for dinner, meeting up with my parents, and we're celebrating something special. I'm starting a new job, and yeah, it's the start of something new, really, to be quite honest. It's a really exciting time, and you know what? I feel like we need to celebrate the wins more, and especially I feel like I need to. So yeah, tonight we're celebrating, you know, the fact that I've just landed a really exciting job. So yeah, stay tuned. I'll fill you in about that later on, but for now, let's go and get some yummy food. So you're the one who brings out the best in me. So I'm back in bed now and it's around 11.30. I've got my Christmas PJs on and I'm ready for bed. Honestly, I'm so tired, but I had the best dinner at Rockpool. I would highly recommend it. The food was just on another level. It was so tasty and delicious. Like I could not fault anything. So yeah, it was just such a good experience, but I'm very tired now. I'm looking forward to having a good night's sleep and I'll check back in with you guys in the morning for a Sunday full of fun. But yeah, good night for now. And I should probably mention I've just done my skincare as well. So I've got a fresh face on. I've put some eye cream on to hopefully cover or help with these bags under my eyes from these early morning starts. But, you know, we'll get there eventually. So yeah, I'm so tired but I always like to take my makeup off before bed no matter what I think it's so important to cleanse so I've done a double cleanse I've got my oil cleanse and then I've done an exfoliating cleanse as well so fresh face so that I'm ready for tomorrow as soon as I get up Good morning everyone and happy Sunday fun day. It's around 10 a.m. and I'm all dressed and ready to go for today. So I'm heading out to go and grab a coffee this morning, a much needed coffee. And I've got this really pretty top on that I wanted to show you. I got it from Zara recently. I love the polka dots. I love the structure. It's something a bit different. Like it's very free flowing, but then it's got this like beautiful neckline and yeah, I just think it's really cute. So I'm heading off to go and grab a coffee and to go for a walk and soak up the sunshine because finally we're starting to have some summer weather here in Melbourne. It has been a slow start, but it's good. And I know you guys love my little weather updates, so I'm just gonna just gonna be myself and throw them in. Just when I thought I'd shared all of my PR parcels with you guys, I got a surprise notice that this arrived from Short Story and Short Story is a brand that I've loved for so long. They've recently collaborated with Disney on the most magical collection and you know, they have all of their kind of traditional products done with a Disney spin. I've gone with my favorite Disney princess, Cinderella. I'm not sure if that surprises you guys, but I do love Cinderella. I think she's just a symbol of hard work and generosity, which is exactly what this beautiful description says. Ever so gentle and kind, Cinderella gives graciously to all, big and small. Hardworking and strong in spirit, she never loses heart, even in difficult times, and always believes believes in magic. So with that in mind, this artwork says, believe in magic, which is something that really resonates with me. And it's done in this beautiful gold foiling. You've then got the origami pieces here, some beautiful butterflies. You know, this is all hand done in Bayswater at Short Story HQ. And this is 42 of 120 pieces in this style. I also got something to do with Aurora because that is my second favorite Disney princess. So I love this. This is actually a diffuser. So I'm going to set this up and take some photos for Instagram, but I am so, so spoiled. Thank you so much, Short Story, for the most beautiful surprise. I mean, the presentation is just incredible. 
I can't wait to put this one up in my room. It's just going to look beautiful and once again, I just love this saying, believe in magic because you know, it, it, it is all around us. I'm not gonna lie, my apartment is a bit of a mess. I've, you know, had people over and I've also been grocery shopping and I'm just unpacking like everything. So this is a little before, before I clean it all up. So hopefully if you're like me and you love seeing before and afters, this is gonna, you know, make you happy like me. So be right back while I clean this mess up. Here is the after, everything is nice and clean again. So I feel like now is a good time to start preparing dinner. So even though it's really early, it's like 6.30, I have closed the blinds and I'm slowly getting ready for bed because I do wake up really early for my internship. I usually wake up at around 3.45 a.m. for my ABC News Brecky uh, morning shift, which is always good fun. Like, I love it there. But um, yeah, the early morning starts are definitely tricky. I'm slowly getting used to them. But yeah, in my PJs, I'll probably make a hot chocolate soon and watch some Netflix and slowly unwind before bed. It's time for me to say goodnight, guys. Thank you so much for watching my weekend vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and to click that subscribe button. Come and join the Frenchie fam. I'd love to have you on board. And, you know, here's me in my PJs. But I'm trying to be as personal as possible in these videos and share more kind of like behind the scenes stuff. So just keeping it real. Let me know if you enjoy that. And I'll see you guys next week in a brand new video then. Have an amazing day because you deserve it. I'll see you soon. Bye.